It's another salmonella warning from the government, and this time, peanut butter is the suspected culprit. This man from Minnesota died after eating contaminated peanut butter. Another 550 people have gotten sick. The source was not discovered until someone got sick in Minnesota. This happened with a salmonella tainted peanut butter. An organization like Team D comes into play and becomes very important because they're the people who are actually talking to the ill people, the cases, and we have a very powerful tool for linking the outbreak to a specific source. Team Diarrhea has been part of the, the Minnesota Department of Health and the School of Public Health here in the Twin Cities for 15 years. We're so lucky to have the School of Public Health here in the Twin Cities and it provides us the pool of students to hire from and that fills a critical need for us. One of my colleagues, Steph Meyer, who's also an alumna uh, of the School of Public Health, noticed that a lot of the cases had eaten peanut butter. Uh, it wasn't until we learned about institutional cases that we were able to link the cases, I and mean, some of the cases, to King Nut peanut butter. The TMD interviews identified that many of the cases that didn't appear to be connected to institution, in fact, did have connections to institutions, which is pretty much what um, solved this outbreak. This is incredibly important and the team helps not only the people of Minnesota but the entire country. As part of the efforts we're doing right now in Congress with food safety, having regional centers of excellence uh, like we have at the University of Minnesota and Minnesota Department of Health, that's what we should have all over the country. So the work of the team is not just important for Minnesota, it's really important for the entire country. The coming together of both the, the students from the University of Minnesota School of Public Health working at the Minnesota Department of Health is the best of all worlds. And it's that combination that has really been impactful uh, in terms of food safety in this country. And it's, it's a gift that both institutions have given to each other and in turn the nation's been the recipient of that gift. It's really enhanced my education by giving me hands-on experience. They're pretty much the leaders in foodborne epidemiology nationwide, so seeing how they do outbreak investigations, how they investigate cases, um, it's been really helpful. This is like an invaluable experience as a student. I couldn't have asked for a better job to really give me some experience um, as a student so that I feel like I can go into a full-time job and, and, and know what I'm doing. We wouldn't be able to conduct these outbreak investigations and be so successful at solving outbreaks if we didn't have team diarrhea.